Hi, welcome to LearnHowToGarden.com. In today's film, we're talking about sowing globe artichokes. If you've never come across a globe artichoke, a fantastic vegetable, but equally the most beautiful flower, so it would fit quite happily into your flower border. If you're not a subscriber at Learn How To Garden, click the link above me right now and just pop it in the email address. It means that every time we put up new written posts on the website, you get to see, you get to see what's happening in our monthly gardening club, and you can see what unique films we do here at Learn How To Garden, as well as being told every time a new film goes live. If you want to grow one plant that is a fantastic vegetable, but also an absolutely stunning architectural plant in your garden, then globe artichokes are the plant to go for. And that's because they are fantastic before the globes or the artichokes start to grow. They've got a beautiful, beautiful foliage and they fit in perfectly at the back of most flower borders or as a feature in a large container. And they're really easy to grow from seed. This variety, Romanesco, which originates from around Rome, has beautiful, slightly purple globes when it grows. To sow them, the first thing you want to do is to get some small modules. And all we mean by modules is a small tray with individual cells. If you haven't got those, then a normal small 5x5x5 five by five by five pot would be fine. And the reason we use ones with individual cells is if we look at these artichokes here that were sown 10 days ago, they germinate at differing times. And because they germinate at different times and they grow very quickly, you want to be able to pot them on individually. And although this particular one here looks like it has large leaves for a seedling, remember that the first two leaves with any seedling are just the seed leaves. It's a real leaves aren't even growing yet. And as soon as the second set of leaves grows and we can see minute roots at the bottom, then we will pot on this artichoke. But to sow them, take some decent multi-purpose compost and fill your module tray. Now a single packet of these seeds from Seeds of Italy will give you more than enough artichokes. You could grow a bed of them or you can have enough that you can give them to your friends. Once the seed tray is full to the top, gently tap it up and down. Artichoke seeds themselves are quite large, so they're easy to sow. You can sow two seeds per module and then thin down to the strongest seedling. And you take your two seeds, push them in about a centimetre, which is normally about a nail width. Nail width. Length of a nail. They'll germinate perfectly on a cool windowsill or in a cool greenhouse. The minute they've germinated, the more light you can give them, the better. Remember, once they've germinated, they can grow at a cooler temperature than they would germinate at. And also, light is more important than heat. You can sow them direct into the ground, but in my experience, you'll get stronger plants by sowing them early. And also, when they go in the ground, if they are attacked by slugs or snails and they are individual plants that are larger, then they suffer less. Once you've filled your tray with seeds, gently cover and then take the tray and immerse it in your sink so the water comes just to the bottom of the tray. Leave it in there until the surface of the compost is glistening with water. Pull out the plug, leave it for 10 minutes to drain. Then just place that onto a windowsill or into a cool propagator. Within 7 to 10 days you will start to see your artichokes germinating. The minute you have fine roots at the bottom and the first two true leaves, 
pot on into a an individual pot. You may need to pot into a 9x9, nine nine, used to be called a 3 inch pot, into one of these. And then they can go out into your flower border, into your container. You could have a row of them in your vegetable garden if you wanted. Sort of end of April, early May, they'll be absolutely stunning this summer. You'll probably get a few artichokes towards the end of the year. Next year, because they're a perennial and they'll come back year after year, you'll get loads of artichokes and they will crop like that for five or six years. After that, you may want to replace them. But let's be honest, five or six years from such a beautiful plant, which is also giving you an exquisite, beautiful vegetable, is great. Most have to be sown each year. These, you sow once every five years.